Fair and Elisa, good afternoon. A split decision from the jury today. They found Jason Lewis not guilty of second degree murder, but guilty of manslaughter. That means there wasn't enough proof, according to the jury, to prove that that death of 13 year old Karan Blake was premeditated. Here's some more about this case. Again, January of 2023, Lewis allegedly heard sounds outside of his Northeast home. He left. That's when he said he heard a shot fired from a car in an alley. Lewis claimed the boy, Karan Blake, ran toward him and Lewis fired a shot and a third shot at him. Blake was killed. The prosecutor said that Lewis wasn't acting in self-defense, didn't wait to see if Blake was holding a gun before firing, and Lewis didn't need to leave the safety of his home, but he chose to anyway before shooting the boy. The prosecutors added that even if Blake was breaking into cars, the teen didn't deserve to die. Penalty for manslaughter in the district, that's up to 30 years in prison. Lewis has no prior criminal record. He spent years working as a D.C. City Parks and Recreation employee, and that is part of the reason why the judge decided that he does not need to be behind bars before his sentencing, only saying that he could be released on the condition he doesn't leave the DMV. Sentencing, that is set for October. In Northwest D.C., Ben Dennis, D.C. News Now.